Hey guys, welcome back to Data with Dominic. And in today's video, we're going to be looking at the uh, count distinct function available to us in PySpark. So let's dive into the demo. As you can see, I've got my Databricks Community Edition set up here, and I've linked to a video of mine in the top right hand corner of your screen where you can uh, see how to set this up for yourself and get access to PySpark for free. But anyways, coming back to the demonstration, uh, what I've done so far is basically just I write a CSV that I had in the D uh, Databricks file store to a data frame variable and then I'm just displaying the data frame here so that you guys get an idea of the data. Very simple. ID, first name, email, gender, salary and it's got about a thousand rows as you can see. So here yeah, and I'm just the first step to use this count distinct function is actually to import uh, the function from pyspark.sql.functions. You can do an import star or you can just do import count distinct. Uh, this collect set is uh, is just to you'll understand why I've uh, called it later in the video, but it's not necessary to use the count distinct function. So how do we use this count distinct function? Say I wanted to get the um, the number of different genders that we have listed in this data frame. How would I do that? What I would do is I would do a data frame, which is the is the variable that we've read the CSV into dot select that is just to query the data basically and then we can do a count distinct remember it's um, d is capital and then inside the brackets uh, for the parameters you have to enter the column name for which you want to find uh, the number of distinct entries so I want to do it for gender so that's all mention gender and at the end you can do a dot display or a dot show um, so Let's see how that works. It's running now. And as you can see, we, we've got eight distinct genders in this column. So some of you might think that's wrong. So that's why I bought the collect set in here. I was just, just to show you um, the proof. So let's get what the collect set does. And I have explained this in another video. I'll link to that. Uh, is basically list out all the uh, unique or distinct um, entries in a column and it lists them out in the form of an array or a list in Python as it's known. So what we do um, we can use it the same way df.select collect set and then within brackets specify the parameter of which column you want to perform the function on and just do a dot display again. So hopefully sh this should return eight unique agendas. So yeah these are the eight unique genders that are available in this data frame that has been um, the data in this data frame was generated by a mock data API so that's where this data is coming from and yeah so that's how the count distinct function works thank you guys for watching don't forget to like subscribe share comment and hit the bell icon and I'll see you guys in the next one